we were going through <laughs> your uh, baseball reference on Wikipedia and something that we were we were kind of surprised by or interested in is that you were drafted four different times. You turned down three. So how, how did that go? Who, who was your like, uh, you know, who were you getting advice or, or was it you or who was saying like, and eh, nah, wait it out, you'll get drafted. Because, you know, for, for the people listening, it was 22nd round, no, 36th round, no, 25th round, no. And then you get the, the fifth round, the fourth yep. time. So, I mean, clearly <laughs> you're getting some good advice. It worked out. Uh, how did that whole, how did that whole ordeal break down? So uh, what I think what a lot of people don't know is so that first year, my senior year of high school, and I got drafted by the Pirates in the 22nd round, I didn't even play my senior year. I got hurt. Mm, I didn't play. Really? So I was, so I, I was, I had strained my UCL in high school. And so the Rangers doctor at the time, he was like, Hey, um, you can, you can't do anything yet, but towards the back half of the season, I was playing first base and outfield, but he's like, you can hit. He's like, you can't get on the mound yet. So I need, I need pitch. I did, I did one workout for the pirates, um, one workout. And then they drafted me off of that. Cause they called me and they wanted to see me. So then, I um, go to San, San Jacinto Junior College in Houston, and uh, I go down there and pitch four innings and get hurt again. And then, mm. you know, I was asleep on my couch in my parents' room and got a call from the Reds in 36 round. And then I just – and then just going through all that, also, I just felt like, you know, I was ready for it but wasn't, like, mature enough yet. And I think just like I didn't, I haven't even shown people what I could do to, you know, get paid just a little bit. So then, you know, go to, I had surgery, I had a stress fracture, so they put a screw in my elbow. So then I missed the rest of my freshman year. And then uh, they had some, I had a me- medical red shirt issues as well. So then I got declared a sophomore, didn't know it. Um, so then I get drafted by the Twins in the 25th round and, you know, didn't pitch. I pitched like eight innings that year and then go to Oklahoma Baptist and, you know, get drafted in the fifth round. But one thing my advisor agent at the time was like, you need to go somewhere, somewhere that's different, new set of eyes on you and just new scouts. So you can build up your stock. But he's like, these scouts have seen you since you were in high school. He's like, so you need some new eyes to see. So that's, that's when I went to Oklahoma Baptist, you know, NAI school at the time. And, you know, and, you know, the velocity was creeping up as well. And then, you know, the champion conference championship game, I got up to 99 and that, that was, you know, that was, just, you know, and my mom was happy too, because she was just asking me after the game, she's like, how do you feel? I said, I said I'm, I'm upset that we didn't, you know, we didn't win, but I said, everything I've went through and just was patient through the process and just like, just basically investing in and believing in myself. You know, it's going to pay off. I mean, sure enough, get taken in the fifth round by the Nationals. So I was like, you know, the, the weight was worth it. Yeah, there you go. Worked out perfectly. And then mm-hmm. and then you also got drafted four times, traded for twice. The Pirates, was it the same scout and, and crew that wanted you back out of high school that then traded for you? Because that's kind yeah. of cool if they were like, we still want you. <laughs> they did. Uh, they were <laughs> still talking. When I went and got traded over there, I remember my first bullpen. It was in Winston Salem, and um, uh, I'm throwing a bullpen in front of a bunch of their, you know, GMs and everybody, and they're like, "Man, why'd you want to sign with us in high school?" You know, and I told them straight up, I was like, well, "You guys weren't gonna pay me." Yeah, yeah you know? no kidding. So I was like, I was like, y'all weren't gonna pay me. So I was like, like, why, why would I sit there and try to take lessons? Why not just bet on myself and go to school? But it was, um, it was, it was a pretty cool thing to come full circle with that organization because you know talking to a bunch of those guys over there they're like man you know we've been watching since high school you've been progressing and stuff so it was it, it was pretty cool i mean yeah I'm, if i'm an organization and we're doing a regular draft we're doing five rounds this year which is ridiculous yeah. regular drafts 40 rounds the first 10 rounds i'm going to go best player available just you know whatever after that my the rest of my picks are going to be six five and above <laughs> pitchers yeah. That's it, dude. Like, I don't know why they don't, more teams don't do that. Like, obviously they saw something in you, like you were projectable. That's what they're going to call you uh, until finally. How many six five pitchers do you think are just in high school? I don't know. I've, I'm I've guessing they for all, all get them, drafted. Bro. I would search I'm for guessing. all of them. And, and the thing is, some... though, like, there's, there's no, like, there's six five pitchers, but how many of them are lefty, though, is the real question. It, exactly. That's, 
it's even more to my point. It's like you, yeah, like the, the whole this 25th, 24th, 23rd round, get out of here with that. Like you have, you have something you can't teach, bro. Like you can't teach six, five, can't, yes, you kind of teach lefty. But yeah. The, and, but the yeah. velos there, I don't know, man. Like it seems like a weird thing that that was the case for you. And then all of a sudden the Nationals snatched you up in the fifth round. Like what? Yeah. But well, then good, good like, for you for it, betting it, on yourself, man. And Trevor, you know, as well, like going through the whole draft process, like those teams will, those teams will like, when you're honest with them and you ask them, like, I'm asking teams like, Hey, what do you see me? Oh, we got you 15th or 20th, you know, stuff like that. I'm just like, okay. Yeah. Like, see ya. whatever. You know what I mean? So it got to the point where I got tired of it. And I just was like, look, I'm gonna continue investing myself. And I got to the point to where I pitched 70, 80 innings and did well. And it shows velocity. And I'm like, it's out there. I'm like, now just, you know, now try to take me at a spot that I like. 